How are you doing? I'm out here with my new bike, well, new to me. It is a Yamaha TW125, Trailway 125, and it is, right now, in its current habitat, it is the perfect bike. You couldn't have something better. I absolutely love it. Um, what is it? Well, it's it's an enduro, or a farm bike, as it's often called. Um, I've heard rumours that these are actually classed in Yamaha as industrial or agricultural machinery <laughs> rather than a recreational vehicle. Um, and why is that? Well, it's because it's designed to be really hard wearing. You can see that the indicators at the front, they're like real uh, flexible. You got no hand guards to get in the way, you got no fairings to get snapped. The only painted part is this tank, which is getting pretty dirty. Um, you can see it's got a high exhaust at the back, which means that you can wade if that's the kind of thing you're into. Um, you've got this just plastic at the back, um, and plastic really almost everywhere, which means that it's very, very unlikely to, to break if you drop it. And if you're taking it off road, of course, you probably will. Um, you've got this drum brake on the back. Uh, people say the brakes aren't very good, and I agree, the brakes aren't very good. You need to be prepared. Um, and then at the front, you've got a disc brake, which kind of has this little red insert on it, which kind of makes it look a bit gnarly. Um, but uh, yeah, the brakes aren't great, but they do the job. So it's got a single cylinder, four stroke engine, which means that it puts out uh, really just enough power to get you, get you, get you going. <laughs> you get up to about 88 kilometers an hour. Um, which means that you know you're not really going to want to be taking this bike if you're commuting on a motorway or a highway um, and taking a look at the speedo this whole section may as well not exist because <laughs> you're only going to get up to about, about here uh, you've got a neutral light indicator a, a high beam indicator and indicators got a little horn uh, you got mirrors so really like it's well enough equipped for um on and off road if you're just going kind of going around town and it's got this fuel tank which carries about uh I think it's seven liters of, uh, of petrol and it's got a reserve as well. So we've got a single cylinder four stroke. There it is. It's a 125cc, um, which if it's, you're looking for something for your first bike, it's really, it's, it is all you need. Um, you're not gonna be able to get up to highway or motorway speeds. Uh, as I was mentioned, 88 kilometers an hour is a top speed and it doesn't accelerate quickly, but it is really very useful for just going around town. He's got a chain with a good protector on the back of it. Um, so the chain uh, should be should be okay. It's pretty pretty hard wearing looking chain for the size of the bike. Um, and you've got a massive sprocket at the back, and I presume a very small one in the in the in the front. Um, and then you've got this huge back tire, which I think does look great. I think it's a great looking back tire. Uh, kind of makes the bike look really rugged. Um, suspension at the front has got good travel. Uh, I did a jump on it today, just a small jump, um, and it was fine, you know, just a small jump. I wouldn't be doing like motocross stuff on it, I don't think it's designed for that, but it's pretty good on a small jump. Let's see what it sounds like if we are to start it up. So, just give it a bit of choke. Choke in. So that's what it sounds like normally. So it's a pretty chilled out kind of sound. So overall, I'm a really big fan of the bike. It's a uh, not too, not too extreme, pretty chilled out. Um, and if it's the kind of thing that you're looking to do is to go off road, but you're not looking to like be a motocross doing jumps and all that, you just want to kind of want to hit trails. This is this is a really good bike for that. Hope you uh, learned something here. And if you have any questions, sure, stick them below, and I will. Uh, see if I can answer. Thanks for your time. Bye-bye.